As snow builds over time and below freezing temperatures, the snow packs and hardens into ice. Once the glacier forms, the pressure of the ice above causes melting at the bottom of the glacier. This buildup of water causes the glacier to move. This is known as basal slip. As the glacier moves, water below fills cracks within the bedrock below and freezes, causing rocks to break off and move with the glacier. This is known as plucking. Glacial movement also forms a type of erosion known as abrasion. This erosion is caused by ice and rocks carried within the glacier scraping along the rock bottom. These scrapes are called glacial striations. The accumulation of rock fragments picked up by the glacier forms glacial till. As this erosion takes place, more heat is formed, causing more melt. The addition of water from this melt allows the glacier to move even more quickly. As the glacier moves, it moves in a U-shape. Eventually, due to external heat, the glacier may begin to melt. This is called glacial recession. The glacier recedes in a U-shape as well. Mass amounts of water will form downhill from the glacier as it recedes. Once the water dissipates downhill, the earth will be left with a U-shaped valley.